What up guys, welcome back to Flash of Feet Gaming. It's been a little while because my PlayStation decided to take a shit on me. Well, fuck yeah. So uh, I was able to get the save data from the cloud and uh, at least be able to take off from where we left off, but you know, it was kind of crappy because we recorded like five episodes. So and, oddly enough, this isn't even the first time shit like this has happened. Yeah, but... Luckily, I had some money saved up to be able to get a new PlayStation, and I was able to get a new one. So, yay. Yeah, which just kind of means that you guys are going to have to wait a little bit longer for our uh, voice audio to sound more professional than it already kind of sounds. Yeah, so it was either get some source files or get a new mic and be like, well, PC-only games. Yeah, right. But then even then, my PC's not that fantastic. So, yeah, I mean, go kill this mage. We're both running pre-mades, you know. <laughs> I mean, mine's an alien, so people are probably like, "Oh my god, alien sploosh!" But it's it's okay. It's not bad. It's a laptop, though. <laughs> the biggest blasphemy of all PCs. Alienware. <laughs> well, you know why people don't like Alien, right? Because they think that they're overpriced. It's exactly it. it. Like you literally pay double the amount that you would pay for a normal computer because of the name and the brand. Even though it's by Dell. So. Oh, girl. oh no. Woo. He has an awesome hat. He looks like he wants to go to the beach. It was like. <laughs> uh, he's supposed to be uh, like a little hint towards um, Big Hat Logan, which was in Dark Souls 1. Okay. He, had the, he was a mage that had this big ass awesome hat. Gotcha. And it was like an Easter egg to be able to get the hat in the first place. You know who they look like to me, though? Um, if you remember in Bloodborne, the really bright white guys, like their skin tone was really white, and they wore stuff like that. And some Did of them they? had, like, the insta-death rod. Oh, yeah. I remember that. Okay. Yeah, that's who they kind of remind me of. Now, those guys needed to go to the beach. <laughs> Luckily, I don't have to go to the beach anymore. I have a pool. <laughs> I can never go to the beach. Oh my god, do you see my arms? I am burnt. I'm fucking burnt. You know what That's weird, because you're Mexican. Yeah, and you know what the best <laughs> part is? I wore a shirt. I wore, <laughs> I wore a long sleeve shirt. No protection. <laughs> no protection. I, like, people make jokes that, like, they need SPF 500. I honestly think that I do. Jesus. Wait, aren't you able to get in that guy's back or some shit? No, that was only in the one area. Oh. Hey, look, the one little creature decided to jump off when I wasn't around. Nice. Oh, God, he's coming. You know what? Fuck it. Just do it now. <laughs> he just jumped up. I'll save you the trouble, bruh. <laughs> My people need me. I must go. Shit, wrong ledge. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Kill yeah. this guy. <laughs> Fuck. He wants to slice off a piece of that man cake. Damn right he does. Extra carrots and shit. What's that little bar down there? What's that mean? That is for bleed. Uh, mm -hmm. If it fills up, it just takes a huge chunk of your health, and it sucks. Okay. So kind of like, uh, what, what was Insanity in Bloodborne? No. Uh, Frenzy. Frenzy. Yeah. But, like, Frenzy took, like, um, oh. Blocked it. Get out of here. Um, Frenzy took you down to, like, a third of your, like, an eighth of your health was left. Okay. This, it just takes off a nice chunk, but the higher resistance, the longer it takes, but I think it's still just a giant chunk just disappears. Okay. I think I'm... <clears throat> oh, yeah, I still have to go through fair and keep. See, like, that's what we, um, in before everything crashed, uh, it saves and everything, and I killed the crystal sage... So obviously the crystal sage is done because I just ran through his area, but uh, I'm gonna. Oh, go and then the tree with the giant balls and herpes on its ass. I think that was still up. Is it? I think so. I don't remember. I should probably watch our videos. I mean, I live it, you know. <laughs> <laughs> live it so to the limit. It's it's kind of like that thing, uh, how I met your mother. You know who hasn't seen Star Wars? The people in Star Wars. And it's because they lived Star Wars. <laughs> that would feel cute, like weird to me. Like going through and just watching the the movies I acted in. Yeah, like, a little bit. Because like, you know it's fake. 
Mm. I mean, of course, it's a movie, so everybody knows it's fake, but... Well, be careful, because now we're going to have a bunch of hate coming in. Star Wars was not fake! <laughs> okay, fly your Millennium Falcon here. <laughs> you just see someone crash through the window. <laughs> hey. <laughs> How are you? Uh, not too bad, yourself. Pretty good, pretty good, you know? Uh, so, Millennium Falcon right here. Oh, uh, that's an X-Wing. Fuck off. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Uh, fair and keep. Okay, I haven't gone through this area yet. This area is a bitch! I should probably go level. Fuck it. Fair and keep? Fair and keep. This fair area is the only area in the game that I can remember that only allows you to have one cooperator, because everywhere else you can have two. Okay. But you can get invaded by, like, three people. It it's reminds dumb. me of World of Warcraft, which I'm still suspended from. Isn't it, like, a year total? And it's six been, like, months. Oh, six months. Uh, it, 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 originally, it was six months, and that was back in October. October, November, December, January, February, March, April. Yeah, so I was supposed to have my suspension lifted last month. But I got on, uh, I tried to get on a couple weeks ago, and it still said that I had two months remaining. Jesus. Yeah. They just kept extending, like, fuck this guy. <laughs> You know, it's stupid because... Alright, so if anybody here has, that's watching this has ever played World of Warcraft, of course you know that the, the struggle is real when it comes to grinding in that game sometimes. Especially if you try to get multiple max level characters. Mm. So, I mean, I, I've had multiple max level characters. It just got really boring and I wanted a priest. So I started working on the priest and then I used this... this uh, What is it called? This program called Honor Buddy. Which allows you... It, it pretty much just plays the game for you. 100%. Does all the questing and everything. Turns it in. Does the grinding that it needs to do. You're poisoned! I am. That dude is poison. Health is draining slowly. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh... I got my priest to max level. And then I was like, you know what, fuck it. I want to do PvP. So I sent my priest in the PvP with Honor Buddy, and uh, it didn't work right. Like, it kept just switching between targets. So I went and rewrote the code for Honor Buddy, and unfortunately it made it too repetitive, and I got caught botting. Oh. Uh. But I did, I did try to fight it, and I was like, I spent a lot of money in this game, and why would I do anything to jeopardize that? And then they sent me an email back, and I'm pretty sure it said... Like, it, w it wasn't professional at all. But, I, like, I don't mind. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> and it wasn't that bad. But they go, like, uh, no. You're still suspended. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, no, fuck it. Like, like, what I don't understand is, like, why do oh, they God. care? You know, like, I don't know why I got poisoned that time. <clears throat> like, why do things care like if you're paying a subscription and you just want to level up a character because you don't have time but you want it leveled up i mean it's not like you're really cheating that much because you're just going through the quest like pvp i can understand but if it's like overall if you're just playing the game for itself to level up to get a little bit further i don't know why they care you know you're paying to be able to play in the first place fucking let it go if it's just for that uh yeah i mean i i can see it for like pve and shit like that for for questing but like when it comes to raids and dungeons yeah it's a little bit different because oh, yeah. when you get to the higher levels of raids you know some uh guilds they're like paid to play just to beat the raid like to be the first guild to beat Ooh. a raid um vanilla wow the very first part of world of warcraft that came out mm -hmm. um there was a raid called next ramus which was then remade in wrath of the lich king and that raid, I think, had, like, a succession rate of, um, like, 0 .0, 0 0.028 or some shit like that. Like, it was actually a really ridiculously low number, and that's because even though there were a ton of people playing, nobody could beat it. That's how fucking hard it was. Like, wow. somehow you needed to manage to get people that have already beat the raid <laughs> in order to beat the raid. It was the dumbest thing ever. That seems retarded. <laughs> and, like, even the remake for Wrath of the Lich King, there were some pretty rough parts. Like, uh, there's a... It, it's broken up into four different quarters. And one's, like, the Arachnid Quarter, and then whatever, whatever, whatever. And uh, the Arachnid Quarter, the end boss is a giant spider. 
and if you didn't kill her in X amount of time, then she frenzied, and it pretty much turns into like a three hit kill, and her attack speed is increased. So her attack speed might go from like one, two, three, and she's only doing like 300 damage a hit. So, done. <laughs> I was like, oh no, she enraged, we're fucked. Oh, so it's kind of like Destiny, how like they had it, at, like the raids in Destiny, if you didn't do it within the time limit, they got a lot stronger mm -hmm. and faster. Except for like in this, you knew that if you didn't do it in a certain amount of time, you're it's just a wipe and you gotta restart. Alright, so... Go ahead. What I'm doing here is there's three towers I have to extinguish flames from, and it lights these three like little things here. Crack, not even once. Never, never. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently you get roast beef vagina. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little, oh my god. Do you remember when we told Josh that in order to fucking, to, uh, when you when you start doing it with a girl and she's a virgin, how you have to press this button and we said it was a clitoris <laughs> and it opens up like curtains? Mm hmm Perfect example. Oh, <laughs> uh, no. Okay. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> These guys are douches. They're they're hard to fight in groups. Actually, he's backing off, so this might not be that bad. They 100% remind me of the uh, the lichens from Bloodborne. Oh, come on. You know what I'm talking about? Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah, you do. Uh-huh. Well. All right, well, I'm going to kill these guys. And then I will be at the next bonfire in the next episode. Well, fuck it, just kill him. We'll okay. see if you can. I mean, if you could do it in like three minutes. This is my baby back, bitch! Uh, uh, is he healing? What is he doing? He was giving himself a buff. Oh. By fucking giving himself fellatio? I suck my own dick and I get stronger! Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I remove ribs and hop! <laughs> <laughs> That's like one of those things, like, would you press the button? You can get stronger by doing one simple task. That task is you have to suck your dick. Would you press the button? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> That's gross. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, everybody. Free surgery, though. You can get them fucking ribs taken out real quick. And for nothing. Uh.